Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe has met visiting Iranian President Hassan Rouhani in Tokyo. The two leaders discussed Tehran's nuclear deal, oil purchases, and the Middle East tensions. Terence Tarashima reports. Despite the strong media interest, Japan wanted to keep the Iranian President Hassan Rouhani's visit a low-key affair. Japan has long had friendly ties with Iran and was a leading buyer of Iranian oil for decades before the U.S.-led sanctions. Experts say Abe has to tread lightly, balancing Tokyo's friendship with Iran while being careful not to upset the United States, a crucial military ally. Washington withdrew from the 2015 Joint Comprehensive Plan of Action, threatening consequences to any firms importing crude oil from Iran. I strongly hope that Iran will fully implement the nuclear agreement and play a constructive role in promoting peace and stability in the Middle East. And we say the best Abe could do is to mediate between Washington and Tehran and prevent tensions from getting worse. The nuclear agreement is significant for Iran, so I strongly condemn the unilateral and unreasonable withdrawal by the United States. I hope Japan and other countries will make an effort to keep this agreement. Tehran has also expressed hope that Japan will resume buying Iranian crude oil. This would defy U.S. imported sanctions, which are severely damaging Iran's economy. But Japanese officials have said Tokyo won't be able to satisfy Tehran's wishes, as Washington has maintained a tough stance against anyone who defies the sanction. Abe also told President Rouhani about Japan's intention to deploy self-defense forces to the Middle East. In response, Rouhani welcomed Japan's presence. In an effort to maintain a sound relation with Washington and uh, Tehran, Abe has decided to send an independent SDA force in a bid to maintain Japan's politically neutral presence in the region. This will be separate from the US-led coalition. However, analysts say Japan is walking a tight rope a situation in the Middle East could take a turn for the worst any time. Terence Teoshima, CGTN, Tokyo. Another update about this meeting between the two leaders. A Japanese official says crude oil purchases were not discussed at meeting between Mr. Rouhani and Mr. Abe. But Japan was a leading buyer of Iranian oil for decades before U.S.-led sanctions. According to Japan's official data, Iranian oil accounted for 5.3 percent of Japan's total oil imports in the year 2017. Then, when the U.S. reimposed sanctions on Iran in 2018, it dropped to 4.2 percent. By October this year, non-existent. The sanctions have hit Iran's economy hard. In April 2018, Iran exported 2.5 million barrels of oil per day. In June this year, only 500 thousand.